tenth place. Symphysidon, colloquially known as Discus, is a genus of cichlids native to the Amazon River Basin in South America. Due to their distinctive shape and bright colors, Discus are popular as freshwater aquarium fish, and their aquaculture in several countries in Asia is a major industry. They are sometimes referred to as pompadour fish. Like cichlids from the genus Pteraphyllum, angelfish, all symphysidon species have a laterally compressed body shape. In contrast to Pteraphyllum, however, extended finnage is absent giving symphysidon a more rounded shape. It is this body shape from which their common name, discus, is derived. The sides of the fish are frequently patterned in shades of green, red, brown, and blue. Ninth place. Macropinna microstoma is the only species of fish in the genus Macropinna, belonging to the Opisthoproctidae, the Baroleae family. It is recognized for a highly unusual transparent, fluid-filled dome on its head, through which the lenses of its eyes can be seen. The eyes have a barrel shape and can be rotated to point either forward or straight up. Looking through the fish's transparent dome, M. microstoma has a tiny mouth and most of its body is covered with large scales. The fish normally hangs nearly motionless in the water. At a depth of about 600 meters 2,000 feet to 800 meters 2,600 feet, using its large fins for stability and with its eyes directed upward. Eighth place. The blobfish is a deep-sea fish of the family Cycrolutidae. It inhabits the deep waters off the coasts of mainland Australia and Tasmania, as well as the waters of New Zealand. Blobfish are typically shorter than 30 cm They live at depths between 600 and 1,200 m 2, feet, where the pressure is 60 to 120 times as great as at sea level, which would likely make gas bladders inefficient for maintaining buoyancy. Instead, the flesh of the blobfish is primarily a gelatinous mass with a density slightly less than water. This allows the fish to float above the seafloor without expending energy on swimming. Seventh place. Cymotha exigua, or the tongue-eating louse, is a parasitic isopod of the family Cymothoidae. This parasite enters fish through the gills. The female attaches to the tongue and the male attaches on the gill arches beneath and behind the female. Females are 8 to 29 mm, 0.3 to 1.1 in, long and 4 to 14 mm, 0.16 to 0.55 in, in maximum width. Sixth place. The leafy sea dragon or Glauert sea dragon, Phycodurus x, is a marine fish in the family Syngnetidae, which includes sea dragons, pipe fish, and seahorses. It is the only member of the genus Phycodurus. It is found along the southern and western coasts of Australia. The name is derived from the appearance with long leaf-like protrusions coming from all over the body. These protrusions are not used for propulsion, they serve only as camouflage. The leafy sea dragon propels itself by means of a pectoral fin on the ridge of its neck and a dorsal fin on its back closer to the tail end. Fifth place. Seahorse is the name given to 45 species of small marine fish in the genus Hippocampus. Hippocampus comes from the ancient Greek hippocampus, itself from hippos meaning horse and campus meaning sea monster. Having a head and neck suggestive of a horse, seahorses also feature segmented bony armor. 
an upright posture and a curled prehensile tail. Seahorses range in size from 1.5 to 35.5 cm, 0.6 to 14.0 in. Fourth place. Pteroys is a genus of venomous marine fish, commonly known as lionfish, native to the Indo-Pacific. Also called zebrafish, firefish, turkeyfish, tasty fish or butterfly cod. It is characterized by conspicuous warning coloration with red, white, creamy, or black bands, showy pectoral fins, and venomous spiky fin rays. Pteroys radiata, Pteroys volatans, and Pterois miles are the most commonly studied species in the genus. Pterois species are popular aquarium fish. P. volatans and P. miles are a recent and significant invasive species in the West Atlantic, Caribbean Sea and Mediterranean Sea. Third place. The deep sea lizard fish, Bathosaurus ferox, is an orlopa form of the family Bathosauridae, found in tropical and subtropical seas across the world. The deep sea lizard fish should not be confused with the true or typical lizard fishes of the related family Cynodontidae. Deep sea lizard fishes were first described in 1878 by British zoologist Albert Gunther who created the generic name from ancient Greek word elements bathos and sauros, meaning lizard of the depths. Previously recognized in the Cynodontidae, in 1996, Robert Carl Johnson al. showed its relationships outside Cynodontidae, in its own family in the suborder Gigantoroidae. At the beginning of the century, Bathosaurus ferox larvae were thought to be a distinct species called Macristium chavesi. Second place. Members of the genus Lophius, also sometimes called monkfish, fishing frogs, frogfish, and sea devils, a various species of Lophi danglerfish is found in the Atlantic and Indian Oceans. Lophius is known as monk or monkfish to the North Sea fishermen, a name which also belongs to Scatina scatina, the angel shark, a type of shark. The North European species is Lophius piscatorius, and the Mediterranean species is Lophius budigasa. The head is large, broad, flat, and depressed, with the remainder of the body appearing merely like an appendage. The wide mouth extends all around the anterior circumference of the head, and both jaws are armed with bands of long, pointed teeth, which are inclined inwards, and can be temporarily depressed so as to offer no impediment to an object gliding towards the stomach, while still preventing its escape from the mouth. first place. The frilled shark is one of two extant species of shark in the family Chlamydos lacidae, with a wide but patchy distribution in the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans. This species is found over the outer continental shelf and upper continental slope, generally near the bottom, though there is evidence of substantial upward movements. It has been caught as deep as 1,570 meters 5,150 feet, although it is uncommon below 1,200 meters 3,900 feet. In Suriga Bay, Japan, it is most common at depths of 50 to 200 meters 160 to 660 feet. Exhibiting several primitive features, the frilled shark has often been termed a living fossil. It reaches a length of 2 meters 6.6 .6 feet and has a dark brown, eel-like body with the dorsal, pelvic, and anal fins placed far back. Its common name comes from the frilly or fringed appearance of its six pairs of gill slits, with the first pair meeting across the throat. That's all, dear friends. 
If you like this video, put likes, leave comments and subscribe to our channel.